And the, the question losing value is a reflection of the failure of leadership, the inability to manage variables that are very important, extremely important certain policy aspects, in particular monetary policy. It is in plain sight, President Hakainde Chilema has felt he doesn't know what he's doing. If you can hear from his audio how he was boasting about how to correct, he was telling the previous government that his failure to lower the cost of uh, the exchange rate, the failure for the previous government to lower the exchange rate of the kwacha and the dollar is an exhibition of failure of government. And indeed, if you look at these real graphs that we have, you'll see that from the moment President Hakainde Chilema was inaugurated on the 24th of August 2021, he has lamentably failed to control the exchange rate. He found the kwacha trading at 16 kwacha 73 ingwe. He told us he would even reduce it to single digit. Alas, today we stand at an exchange rate sustained homage of the kwacha despite all the unethical even interventions from the bank of zambia he is not even paying uh debt right now the payment of debt has been suspended but if you look at the numbers these are the real graphs president akande chilema who sink this country even in more misery if you look where we are he found it at 16 kwacha 73 where today the kwacha is trading at a waste rate of 20 kwacha plus, it is becoming very concerning that this government does not know what it's doing. President Hakai Dechilema was speaking things that he does not even understand and people of Zambia believed him and gave him the mandate. Today, if you look, it is trading at 20. He has totally failed to control it. There is nothing that is done to the economy. Our kwacha is weakening each and every day. And this is a total sign of failure. It does not even have a policy direction on how it's going to improve this problem. He went to the IMF to say he was going to bring debt restructuring. Has he restructured even a dime to them? No. We remain totally unrestructured. It is just pante pante. This country, if we continue with this man, beyond 2026, this country is going to crash. He has got no plan, he has got no agenda, and he's just making the cost of living go deep because he has no regard to inspire the Zambian people because real development can only spread by reinvigorating the manufacturing base of the local people. But he's always looking to America, always looking outside. That's not where our solution is. Our solution to develop is local here. We have the minerals, we have the resource, we have the manpower. What we need is a government of vision that which you will prioritize developing our local resources and to make them viable. With this government, this is the real graph. You see where we are coming from. It was inaugurated at uh, 24th August and the exchange rate was 16 quarter 73. Look how he has just been doing chipante pante on this graph. And this is a fact. Zambia 2026, it is time for change. Let us put up a new invigorated revolutionary economic freedom fighters. Let us put up Pan-Africanism and let us develop Zambia. It depends on us and we can do it. Not people who are putting the interest of foreigners against those of Zambians. This is Kason Demwenda, the president for the economic freedom fighters. Wherever I want to go, our feet will take us there.